everyone! Welcome to Storytime. My name is Caitlin and today we're at the Vancouver Island Regional Library Port Alberni branch. So before we get started with today's story time, and I will tell you what today's story time theme is after, we're going to begin with our hello song. So our hello song has a little bit of sign language that goes along with it, but don't worry if you don't know it, because I'm going to go back through the signs for everybody before we sing it together. So our first sign is hello, and to do that, we're going to pretend like we're giving a salute. Can you do that with me? Can you sign hello to me? Perfect. Now our next sign is friend, and our two pointer fingers are going to give each other a hug twice. So one, two, and that's our sign for friend. Now our next sign is it's time, and to do that, we're gonna point to our wrist and pretend like we're wearing a watch. So point to your wrist like you're wearing a watch and then just say, it's time. And then our final sign to say, our hand's gonna come out from our chin like this. So all together, our signs are hello, Friends, it's time to say. Are you ready to sing it with me? All right. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. It's time to say hello. Good job, everybody. So hello, I hope you're having a really wonderful week. Now, I wonder if you can guess what today's story time theme is based on what's on my dress today. So I've got some balloons on my dress. So is there anything you can think of where we might need balloons? That's right, we're talking about birthdays today. So my birthday was actually last week. So I wonder, is it anybody's birthday today? Anybody's birthday this week or next week? Let me know. But for today, because today's story time is all birthdays, today it's everybody's birthday. So we're going to sing happy birthday, but we're going to sing it to everyone. Are you ready to sing with me? All right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to everyone. Happy birthday to you. Good job everybody. So our book today covers what I think is one of the most important things when it's your birthday and that is the birthday wish. So today's story is 10 rules of the birthday wish according to Beth Berry and Tom Witchenhelf. And this book is published by GP Putnam and Sons. So 10 rules of the birthday wish. There are 10, most definitely 10, very specific, tried and true, and absolutely essential rules for the making of the birthday wish. In case of any confusion about the number of rules, you can place your hands here. So we've got 10 fingers and we've got 10 rules that this book's gonna walk us through. Rule number one, it must be your birthday or close to your birthday Sometime in the last or next week, your age should have increased by one, unless you are a beetle, bug, or insect. If your life cycle is one month, a week, or only a single day, please celebrate immediately, ASAP, flutter, flap, Fly right on over to rule number two. So only if you are a bug do you get to celebrate your birthday that early. Rule number two, you must have a party, a celebration, hoopla or jamboree. There should be games and laughter and definitely hats. Hats immediately elevate the party mood. Food is also a good idea. See rule number three, as are streamers, confetti, and balloons. Unless, what do you think the unless is? 
unless you are a rhinoceros. If you are a rhinoceros, a swordfish, a sea urchin, or pointy in any way, you may want to skip the balloon. So you've got rhinoceros, pop, swordfish, pop, sea urchin, pop. So if you're pointy in any way, maybe skip the balloon. Rule number three, you must have cake or cannoli or cream puffs or churros. Your dessert does not specifically have to start with the letter C, even if some of the best desserts do. The letter could be P or B or even I. Whatever letter your dessert starts with, it must be sturdy enough to accommodate rule number four. What do you think rule number four is that the dessert has to be sturdy enough? Rule number four, you must have a light or lights to blow out. Traditionally, this would be a candle, but it could also be a sparkler, unless you are a whale or a frog. So no matter what dessert you pick for your birthday, it has to fit some sort of light. I like sparklers. If you are a whale, you may want to invite some fluorescent jellyfish to your party. If you are a frog, consider using fireflies as your candles and your dessert. Combining rules is completely acceptable. Either way, something light must... So what happens when, when you've got your candles on your cake? What do you typically do? That's right, you blow them out and the lights go dark. Rule number five, there must be singing. So we did this earlier. Traditionally, the happy birthday song, sung happily and loudly and definitely off key, unless your friends are feathered. Wouldn't you like to have some dogs sing you happy birthday? I think that would be pretty fun. If you're lucky enough to have friends who can warble, croon, and carry a tune, sit back and enjoy the show. So I guess if you're a bird, the happy birthday song is a little bit easier to sing on tune. Rule number six, you must close your eyes. Closing your eyes keeps your wish safe inside your head where it can grow from something ordinary into something extraordinary. So very important to close your eyes. Rule number seven, you must take a deep breath. This will ensure the success of rule number nine, unless you are a puffer fish. If you are a puffer fish, definitely do not take a big breath because then you will puff up and all of your guests will be concerned. Everyone knows a puffed up puffer fish is not a happy puffer fish and happy is a pretty big part of birthday. Rule number eight, you must make a wish. Just one wish, a single wonderful amazing wish. It can be a big wish or a little wish. It can be a now wish or a later wish, but it should definitely be a can't think of anything greater kind of wish. So do you wish for all kinds of wonderful things on your birthday? Let's see what we've got wishes. We have wishes to fly. We have wishes to go on a tropical vacation ice cream to score a gold, float with balloons, really cool wishes. Rule number nine, you must blow out the candles in one single breath, unless you are a camel. I wonder why camels are accepted. 
If you were a camel, you will most likely spit on the cake as you are blowing out the candle. No one wants to eat cake spritz with camel spit, so please ask your friends to help. Combining breaths is completely acceptable. Instead of the camel blowing them out, he might spit all over the cake. His friends are helping blow out his candles. But you see someone who's not paying attention? Look at a silly moose up there blowing bubbles. There's a note here, and it says moose are notoriously bad at following directions. Now that poor moose just got a little confused about exactly what they were blowing. He's blowing bubbles. Rule number 10, don't forget that wish ends in shh. So keep your wish quiet, silent, and hush. And when the fun is done and your friends have left and the moon is high in the sky, close your eyes and dream of your wish coming true. And that is the end of 10 rules of the birthday wish according to Beth Berry and Tom Lichtenheld. So I like that book. I think that's very helpful to know that there are 10 rules to make a birthday wish. So we have sung the happy birthday song. We have now learned all of the rules to make a birthday wish. So what else do we typically have on our birthday? That's right, we have food. So I have a song about one of my favorite foods for my birthday. Mm -hmm. yep. There we go. Pizza. So if you know the song Bingo, it's the same tune, instead we're going to be singing about pizza. So it goes, there is a treat that's good to eat, and pizza is its name, oh, P-I-Z-Z-A, 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 and pizza was its name, oh. And now, I'm going to take away one slice, and just like Bingo, when we get to this first letter, we're going to clap instead of saying the word P. There is a treat that's good to eat and pizza is its name-o. I-Z-Z-A, 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 and pizza is its name-o. Take another slice to remember. Now we've got two letters that we're gonna clap. There is a treat that's good to eat and pizza is its name-o. Pizza is its name, oh. I think you've got it now. There is a treat that's good to eat, and pizza is its name, oh. Set A. Set A. Set A, and pizza is its name, oh. There is a treat that's good to eat, and pizza is its name, oh. A. A. A, and pizza is its name, oh. There is treat that's good to eat and pizza is its name oh and pizza is its name oh good job everybody that song made me hungry so we have one more song that we're going to sing for our birthday story time but I'm gonna let my song cue pick what our final song is so I'm gonna give it a toss Ooh, okay, we're gonna sing the wheels on the bus. All right, so get out your wheels. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round, all through the town. Now the wipers, the wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 beep. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 all through the town. The people on the bus go up and down, up and down, up and down. The people on the bus go up and down, all through the town. Great job, everybody. So we are at the end of our birthday story time. I hope you had fun learning how to make a birthday wish and singing about pizza with me. 
So before we go, we're going to just finish with our goodbye song. So it's just like our hello song we sang at the beginning, but now instead of saluting hello, now we're just going to wave goodbye. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Thank you for joining me for birthday story time today. Happy birthday, and I hope I'll see you again real soon. Bye.